Former BBC royal correspondent Jenny Bond has said that Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are oblivious to the insensitive surrounding their attempt to fly alongside the President of the United States. The couple reportedly requested to fly back to the US following Queen Elizabeth II's state funeral in Air Force One, alongside President Joe Biden and Jill Biden, the US First Lady. Their request was denied by American officials over fears that it could harm relations with the royal family, but the mere fact that they asked has caused quite a stir. Ms. Bond said that the request implied that the couple have a diluted idea of their status on the world stage. The couple have lived in the U.S. since 2020, following their decision to step down as senior royals. Meghan Markle wanted to be top dog but that was always going to be for Kate Ms. Bond told OK, the fact that Harry and Meghan's people have not denied that they asked to fly on Air Force One certainly suggests that it is true, and that points to two things. Firstly, they have a very grandiose and eluded idea of their status on the world stage. And, secondly, they are impervious to the sensitivities of the situation they have created by stepping back as working royals and then firing volleys of allegations at the royal family from their Californian haven. Surely they could see that it would, and did, put the president in a very awkward position by asking him effectively to take sides in the family rift. How very insensitive! Hollywood flops Harry and Meghan come up short as Spotify take £34 million hit Meghan and Harry were in the UK last September to attend various work commitments, however, the couple extended their trip following the death of Queen Elizabeth II. The couple, who travelled to the UK without their two children, attended the late monarch's state funeral on September 19, 2022. Meghan and Harry flew home to the US soon after the funeral, supposedly wanting to get back to see Archie and Lilibet. This was when the pair asked to fly home in Force Air One with the Bidens, which was declined. Don't miss! Meghan just wasn't up for the job of being a hard-working royal, says old pal, details, royal family live. Forward Palace vow to make Sussexes nervous, live, Meghan Markle and Prince Harry dreams of conquering US coming to end, exclusive, Meghan and Harry announced their decision to step down as working royals in January 2020. The couple, along with Archie, moved to California. Lilibet, who is now two years old, was born shortly after the move. 